In this presentation, we are going to look at using uh, Venn diagrams in set theory. Now, the question here is as follows. It's a short question. Suppose we have a labeled Venn diagram depicting the events A, B, and C in such a way that they divide the universal set into eight regions. Now, the job relates to this subset X, which is a subset of U, and it's defined by the following uh, membership table. So what we're going to do is uh, draw out the Venn diagram and then shade in the areas that correspond to X. So again, so I'm going to have the membership table on the next slide. There it is, and I'm going to work off this. So first off, let's draw, uh, draw up our Venn diagram. I'm going to start off with just drawing it uh, out the universal set. Pardon my uh, skill. So this is going to correspond to the universal set here. I'm going to draw in the regions A, B, and C. So I'm going to draw A here. I'm going to draw B here. And I'm going to draw C here. Now, just to sort of emphasize something, I'm going to sort of number off all of the regions. So there is the region that uh, outside A, B, and C, the union of A, B, and C. So this is the first region here. The second region is, uh, I'm not going to do them in the same order as this, I'm just going to num number them off as I have here. 3, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. Those are the 8 regions uh, constructed by A, B, and C. I'm going to call this one A, this one B, and this one C. Okay, now, so I'm going to shade it in in black. Now, what we're going to do is, uh, for each of these uh, rows here, I'm going to pick out where X is 1. So, X is 1 here, 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 and here. So, it's X is corresponds to four of these regions. Now, so in the first region, uh, A is 0, B is 0, but C is 1. So, this corresponds to the C only region. So, that is going to be this region down here meant to put that in black but never mind that is the first one there uh, that will correspond to uh, what I have down there as region 8 the next region is A only so that's going to correspond to region 2 and let's shade that in there so okay the next region is A and B Sorry, A and C, but not B. So it actually corresponds to this region over here, region 5. This is where A is, is part of A, part of B. Sorry, part of A, part of C, but not part of B. So I'm going to shade this one in now as well. That region there. Next, we are going to uh, look at the last one there. So that was region 5, and A and B. So part of, uh, the part of the universal set that is part of A and part of B only, not part of C. And it actually corresponds to what I have down here as region 3. That region there. So let's shade that in. So there we go. So that is our... Uh, area X. It corresponds to the sh areas I have shaded in there in blue. I'm just going to sort of draw over it uh, the outline in black just to sort of make it a bit clearer. Anyway that ends our presentation.